One, go! Alright, I'm back, and so is Scythe. What's up? Alright, so... Uh... Sago just beat Ellis. What was the second? 3 0. Yeah, that matchup's a little weird. I also don't know if you looked at the challenge, but baseball beat Metroid. Oh. Uh, so he still has to, has to play Sago, Kells, no Octo, and you. Mm -hmm. Yeah, still plenty of Smash to go. Yeah. We're only halfway through. Actually, a little more, I guess. Yeah. But now we're gonna have Italian Ninja vs. Octo. Are both of these players still winless? Uh, let me take a quick I, look. Wait, no, I, I can't be right there. Ninja... Ninja has yet to win. Octo... Uh... Octo beat Bro. Ah, oh, okay. And Octo takes the early lead here. Yeah. Ninja does not seem to be playing his best today. Definitely, I think he's oh, a more God. solid player than 05 oh, shows, you know? What? I think that, I was just saying that I think Ninja is, uh, you know, a better player than it, you would, than it seems if you look for Oh, uh, yeah, certainly, but you have to remember that everyone else in here is also a very solid player, so... That's true. Someone has to get the losses, unfortunately, he, um, hasn't won a set yet. Yeah. Has he played Ro yet? I don't know. Because I think they're both uh, at that? 0 and 5 right now. No, they play last round 9. So we will see how that goes. Yep. Well, not for a bit. But in the meantime, Octo Ninja's trying to get the kill. Yeah, Octo holding a solid game there now, too. So there's a. A double smash sent here of playing Melee Battlefield with the janky Mind Game Legends and Dark Link. Yeah. Where you can't see him here, too. He's invisible. Yeah. It's ridiculous. I don't even... Do you like Dark Link as a costume? It's not bad. I mean, it's a cool... I mean, it's not like they just pick, like, oh, he's dark. I mean, it's from the game. So. Yeah. I don't know if I like that. I, I mean, know. as long as it isn't just some... Like, makes no sense. I mean, that's it's definitely yeah. a character in Zelda, so... Yeah, you know, I get it as a costume. I don't know, I just don't like the design of it that much. Yeah, I mean, if you're not into dark stuff, you're just such a nice guy, sucker. I guess so. Can't stand the thought of Link being evil. I guess so. Got my pink shirt on today. Yeah. Now, Octo's combos this match have been off the chain. They've been ridiculous. Yeah. Ninja finally gets another kill here, but it's looking real grim. So, hmm. I'm trying to think what Link's goal in this match is. Is it, is it to keep Link's nest out? So he's just getting comboed like crazy. You know, I would imagine it's gotta be. Uh, I would think that in this matchup it's important to keep Ness out. Uh, and even if he does get in, you've got a poke in the I would think. Uh... Yeah, I think he, what he wants to do is he wants to use his projectiles to sort of keep Ness out, and then when the opportunity presents itself when he lands, uh, he needs to just confirm those boomerang hits and bomb hits into some combos of his own. Yeah. I'm trying to think how he's supposed to edge guard Ness. I think the best way would probably be like punish the upbeat with like a bomb into there or something. Something like that. Yeah, I mean, he could toss a toss a boomerang or shoot an arrow to try to stop him while he's looping the up around. I had the craziest upbeat gimp on freaking Octo. I lasered, and I it was aimed right for Octo as he was upbeating, and it went to his feet. Oh, right when yeah, the upbeat yeah, was yeah. about to hit him, and it just like stopped it. Yeah. <laughs> so he just died. I was like, well, that was on purpose. That was crazy. Too good. Oh my god. This is so lucky. 
Oh my god, he's dead. Oh, okay. Brutal. Ninja hits away all the shy guys while he's at it. Ninja can't let him over, get over, can't let can't let himself get overrun like this. He needs to make a wall. Yeah. See here, he shouldn't he shouldn't have uh, sort of approached there. Yeah, I think he's playing too aggressive now. Yeah, I think he's just trying to match the aggressiveness that uh, Octo's doing, but the punishes that Octo are, Octo's gonna get are gonna be way more than uh, what Ninja can get here. Yeah. Kinda has to. Like we said, he has to build a wall, but he has to, you know, if he does go aggressive, he has to be very particular about his spacing. Because if he whiffs something and Octo gets the punish, then. Oh. Right. It's not neat. So just the way this matchup should go is that Ness should have a lot less opportunities to win in neutral. But yeah. when he does get it. Win in neutral, his punishes will be stronger than Link's. Right. But the way that Ninja's playing is that they're getting like the same amount of wins in neutral, or maybe even that's getting more, and his punishes are just that much more powerful. Yeah. And Ninja tends to fall behind just because of that. What do you think about this stage as a counter pick for Ninja? I. From what we were talking earlier, I think this is not a good next stage. Right. So I, I say it's fine. Okay. Although I, I don't know how it is as a link stage either. Um, it kind of depends if like up tilt and stuff can reach that platform. I think it's good because short hop up air can okay. reach it. All right. Yeah, I saw Octo took you here, and I was thinking, oh, you know, Scythe was. And I won Scythe that game. Must be pretty okay <laughs> with this. I'm actually not too big of a fan with this stage with Wolf. It's not bad. There's just some weird oh. jank ledge stuff that can happen. Okay. On the flat, on the stage, because like because of the like tilted edge. Or? Yeah, if I try to forward smash on it, I'll just fly off or something. Oh really? Okay. Yeah, it's kind of bizarre. Huh. Okay, that's kind of the punish I was hoping Ninja would go for. Uh, just bomb into down air on Ness's recovery. He tried it, but um, just mistimed the bomb. I'm not sure when he's supposed to time it, but okay, apparently it wasn't like that. Good sweet spot. So Octo, like, whenever he's recovering back to the stage, he almost always fares, like, on the way back. Yeah, he's going for a long time. I feel like Ninja can probably just, um, upbeat him one of these days when he tries to double jump fair back on. Yeah. Do you know, uh, can, if Octo's recovering from low and Ninja upbeats just on ledge, you, how often do you think Octo would hit it? You mean he's just standing there upping? Yeah. Um, I imagine it would probably go in Octo's favor. You think so? Yeah. Okay. It kind of depends where he's coming from. Okay. Yeah, even if, if he's coming from below. It depends also on how close Ninja is to to the ledge. If he's like not that close to it, and, then he should be fine. Because if the sword is covering the ledge That's and he's like I'm backed thinking. up. If Sword covers the edge and Octo's going like straight up with his up Yeah, he should lose that. Okay. That should be an edge guard. Thing is, Octo's been getting good sweet spots, so I don't think that'll That's true. come across. But um, it kind of, you, if you edge guard like that, what you're doing is you're betting it against how good Octo is in recovering. Yeah, so if you don't think Octo can consistently sweet spot his up like that, then you might as well go for that sort of scrubby uh... Edge guard, yeah, but it's not so scrubby against Ness because it's really hard to do the sweet spot. Yeah. So that's like generally the bad thing to do. Like you know, most players are gonna sweet spot the ledge, and you're just gonna have this laggy up beyond the stage, and you'll get punished. Right. But it may work against Ness. Yeah, throwing a move out right away is generally the best idea. But yeah, if it's so hard to sweet spot with like Ness or uh... Lucas, I, Lucas, yeah, Lucas being a sloppy. Whoever. Even links can be a little weird sometimes with that hitbox. Right, like a good example is that, say we were on actual melee battlefield, you can't ride up the ledge, so it's really good there against like Spacey's or anyone. Yeah. Because I can't uh, sweet spot it really. Yeah. Some stairs. Another good start to a match for Octo. Just a down air into up air, and that's a stack. It's a struggle for Ninja. Yeah. 
He's yet to crack the mystery. Yeah. That is this nest. Yet to crack the code. Yep. And this kid in his pajamas. I think this is my favorite pajama nest color. I tip typically like all the green colors in the game the best. Yeah, green is generally good. Except the Falcon. I don't like green Falcon, yeah. Uh, I don't like green Kirby. I like green Kirby. Really? I think the other Kirbys are still way better though. Okay. They're so vivid. Yeah. Except I just white Kirby. Like, I white Kirby's like, the worst. Yeah, it's definitely. Still dumb. I don't like green Kirby's shoes. <laughs> what are they, like brown or something? They're like yellowish. I don't know. Yeah, they're weird. Ooh, nice little combo there. And I, I know we kind of weren't talking about the match yeah. there, but it's just... It's been the same for the past two games. He's just yeah. getting overrun over and over again. He's not able to keep the nests out, so he's just paying for it. Over. Yeah, it doesn't even seem like he's really trying to set up the projectile wall. Um, which, I mean, it's harder than it seems, of course, but he's, he's approaching a lot. He doesn't really have to Yep. Nice little bomb jump there. Yeah. <laughs> awesome. That's a really cool tech. Yeah, he's like, what's he do? He like throws it down and... He, he like drops it down and then he down bees and drifts over and hits it to make it blow up. With what? What's he hit it with? With the, er, excuse me, not down bees, down air. So he does like a glide toss down, then down air? Yeah. That's pretty sick. Yeah, it's really cool. <laughs> it looks like... Such such a suicidal way to go about doing that, but that's funny. Yeah. Or I don't think he even really glide tossed. I think he just z dropped. It. No, I, he definitely had some momentum going down. Oh, did he? Okay. It definitely looked like he was sort of teleporting us down a bit. Okay. Good punish. Oh yeah, that was really good. Stuff. I didn't think that was gonna land. It was good. Well timed. So he still have a, has a shot here. Needs to get get a nice little link combo going. Some dash attacks, some tilts, and an edge guard. Oh no. That's not gonna do it. Looking more and more grim. And I'll do it. Yep. Octo takes that 3 0. Good stuff to Octo.